Test in Test Match Cricket. My memories of the 100, I'd just come back into the team and I'd replaced Peter Hanscom, you know, who's you know, a really good friend of mine and so that was always hard but to get another opportunity of playing Test Cricket was, you know, I was really excited and I was coming off some really good form in Shield Cricket. I sort of went into that week really confident, the team was playing really well so I sort of just tried to slip back in. I still remember on day one I dropped a catch on first slip. At times in my test career I'd been under a lot of pressure, you know, so you want to come back in and just do well and when I dropped that catch I just, I was like, oh here we go again. But I managed to strike that off, I think I came in at about 4 for 200, which as a number 6 is probably the best time to come in. And yeah, just had an awesome partnership with Steve Smith. Oh that's 4. Yeah, I got a couple of nice drives away early and so that just got me going. Obviously they made, I think, 400 in the first inning, so we knew we had to get get a big score on the board to get back into the game. Oh, super shot from Mitchell Marsh. Once you get into a partnership and things start to flow, and then once you get to 100, it's probably the only time that batting becomes really fun because you can sort of relax a bit and you feel good. Me and Smudger were just having fun, and he's so good to bat with. You know, sort of in his own little bubble most of the time, but we're out there the best in the world, so. Good fun. Oh, he's got it. He's got it. A hundred in front of his family, in front of his home crowd, and his first in Test match cricket. Being at home, being in front of my family and friends, being on the home deck. Um, yeah, it was a very special day. Something I'll never forget. You, know, you look back on that, and that partnership was you know, significant throughout that for that game and um, for Australia winning the Ashes. So it's something that I'm you know, really proud of.